isn't real. This isn't real. This isn't real. And you see, when she says this is not real, she's able to crack the illusion of this box. So this means every time when you go to sleep, yeah, before you sleep, you must reprogram your mind to understand this. Okay? Before you go to sleep, yeah, you must say, this isn't real, this isn't real, this isn't real. You, you must affirm this or you, in order for you to break these geometrical prisms that your brain is thinking inside of. Okay? Is it a statement? You see, this isn't real. Okay. And you're able to break. You're able to break the illusion. Okay. Just through this aff affirmation and reverse engineering of this whole thing. Okay. Your ideas of Christianity, your ideas of Hebrew, Egyptian, your ideas of all the government, 5G, all your ideas are. Uh, FG told me we used to be oh, there's, there's aliens and all of this. It's just nonsense to distract you from the true way of getting out of this nonsense is this. Is even asking, how did you do that? How did you break the glass? How did you break the glass? How did you break the glass? How do you break the glass? <laughs> and as you can tell, this person is struggling to get out of this cube. Okay. And what's the reasoning behind them showing you that it's difficult to get out of this cube when you react like this? Okay, so what would be the, the right reaction for this? Okay, so as you can tell, this person has gone down into the deep. And in the going on in the deep is an illustration to show you how you can go down into your unconscious brain because the sea is similar to your brain. So this person had to go underneath the water to illustrate this. So what happens when you go down into the bit where your true self is? This is where we're trying to get you to, which is the unconscious brain, the subconscious brain. Not the conscious mind is a different brain which operates on different frequencies. But when you go down into your unconsciousness, okay, or nothingness, or the abyss, abyss they call it, which is darkness. Darkness, which is the space which God created the world. What happens when you get there? Okay. What happens when you face yourself in this darkness? Maybe it's, it's too scary to face this. So what's, what's better for you to hear is how many vegetables you can eat, how much alkaline water you're drinking, how much, how much you know about the government doing 5G and all of these things. This is where we want, this is, this is where you don't want to go. You don't want to go into the, you want to go into the conscious brain where you can talk about vegetables all day and talk about our chem, chemtrails all day. Okay, but this you don't want to go into this. But you want to talk about how how your one of your granddad was was a native Indian. Who cares? Nobody cares about native Indians, bro. Different. Okay. What are you going to learn above this? It's just rubbish. Okay, just generic information, mediocre stuff. But when we get down into the deep, okay, of the brain. We get into this space, the abyss, darkness, the unconscious brain, 
hear this and this is what I'm trying to tell you and you still don't get it how many times have I, have, have I illustrated this how many times how many times shall we do this okay how many times this isn't real you see and this is what we're telling you and you can only get this understanding when you get to this level of the brain. So your brain patterns have to be tuned into this frequency. Yeah? Okay? 